tell you everyone and welcome back to another episode of Civilization 5 Brave New World playing as the uh, the Egyptians on the standard game page which has gone surprisingly fast surprisingly yes that was my response surprisingly stadiums yeah building stadiums and the Louvre yeah you can get 20 of those. <laughs> now, Louvre is really good. Wonder. Actually, let's uh, see what it, what it what it does. It's actually it's the best um, it's the best wonder for uh, tourism slots in the game. And I will show you why when it lets me do it. Because the Zulus have a giant empire and therefore require more time to do things. There we go. And hop up. Yeah. So it gives. Well, it gives a base of two culture, plus the three from the World Congress, three great artists, and four great, uh, great, well, great, great artist as slash artifact slots. And you can actually put uh, two, you put, well, you have to put two art slots in and two, um, and two, uh, what's it called? So art and, oh, artifacts, sorry. <laughs> it's getting a bit derpy there, herba derba. <laughs> Ooh, part of me. <laughs> We're gonna get another great writer, so we'll get more social policies. Social balls. Social balls. Be cool, Rabbi Yes, more gold. Gold is always appreciated. So yeah, funnily enough, if the uh, Zulus actually, uh, you know, grabbed this, uh, like you know, got this tile with one of their cities, we'd be completely cut off, which is hilarious. And kind of sad. Hopefully that won't happen. I don't think it will. And yeah, we rigged the elections, so that's good. Got another search posh here. Woo! Upcoming session of obviously the world leader. Whoa! Oh my god. Wait a minute. What do you mean? Hmm. Oh, do they? Oh, they do have that air. Oh, can we launch a nuke from there? We can not. Ooh. That is neutral. What if I pay you 50 gold per turn? That is really annoying. Hang on, so. Yeah, so we need to get what? One, two, three, f four tiles. We can't do this any other way. Well, we could if we'd gone around the other damn way. I didn't realize that he'd actually already gotten that tile. Uh, that is actually kind of extremely frustrating. Because how long? Okay, how long would it take us? I know. But I, the thing is, I want to get this right. So, nine turns. You know what? Do it. Thing is, I can do it there, but it'd be very costly for us. Yeah. No. Besides, we have, like, that long to do things. Alright, what do I want? Because I could go down things further. Oh, that's, that's not really useful anymore. Neither is consulates. No, no. Not really. I think freedom. We'll just keep going down freedom. Yeah, we'll get <laughs> capitalism. Capitalism! And then we're gonna grab the last of the uh, the second tenant thing. They purchase with faith. Really? Oh, probably a missionary. Oh, and the, the pagoda. Yeah. Ten turns. That'll be shortened by the fact that we'll get a great rider. That is awesome. Yeah. So I suspect the game will either end... Oh, not this episode. Another one or two more episodes. Yeah. One or two. You could hear somebody hawking in the background. That was disturbing, but oh well. Um, so yeah. Yes. So, bombers are over there. Where are the nukes? Because we've got to make sure that those nukes are not going to be anywhere close. I think they're still just over here. Yeah, they're just sitting up. Oh. <gasps> oh, he's moved them. It's a Colombo. That's insulting. I love that city-state. That was such a good city-state. Well, it's my favorite city-state in the world. But yeah, there's no way I could liberate that. 
So yeah, my goal is to nuke you, Lundy. Like twice. Just absolutely nail it into the ground. But then again, maybe I should go for Moscow as well. Maybe. Hmm. Like, it's, you know, it's an option. Because, I mean, it is pretty significantly large as well. No, I just want to, I want to nuke his original territory. That's what I want to do. I want to make him know that there are consequences to conquering the world. And consequences that can't really be answered in full. Alright, Phoebes has grown. Yes! We've got to 40 population here. I'm actually going to fill up all the, the specialist slots if I can. Which I probably can actually do. Fill on that. Well, the stuff that we are working that could be cooler. Yeah, because I don't really care if the city grows anymore. It's not too bad if it doesn't. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah, that's okay. We'll work the windmill. This is more scientist point. Yeah, I, I just like working a city to its full uh, specialist capacity because it is fun. Right, what can we do without? Oh, not much actually. At this stage, yeah. I suppose we will have to get rid of this one. Yeah. Yeah. I like the nice 40 though. Um. Then again, I have this idea of uh <gasps> maybe. Ooh, maybe. Maybe gets 42. The answer to life, the universe, and everything. Well, if it backfires, that would suck. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. We have 18 specialist slots being worked, but that's so cool. I love that. Like, that's a that's the maximum you can ever get for for all your cities. Um, unless you've got, like, a modded civ or something. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. No, it's fine. Nice even 40. I like that. See if we can get this to uh, to forty as well. This one not so much, Shadley, but Airwell, Airwell, the Zulu territory. What is he building now? And look at all the production he has there. Got quite a massive amount of production in the city. That's four, five, six manufactories around his city. Whew, that is huge. That is, I mean, that's colossal production. As well as the copper, he's got coffee, just everything, you know? Wow. And the, and the wheat obviously helps him to grow that city. But yes, I would like to see it, if the uh, thing will let me do so. No. Let me see your city. Eventually. Hmm... <laughs> right, there we go. You Lundy. So he's building research. <laughs> he doesn't have as many things to work. Yeah, there's his living tower and his statue of Zeus, Major Castle. The only free wonders he actually built in the city. Mm. Ah. And there's his Ikanda. Where is it? Uh, there. That is amazing. Yeah, unique promotions to pre-gunpowder uh, melee units. Oh, it is amazing. I've never played as the Zulu, but I have seen them in action in another Let's Play by Marbergier. And we, uh, wow. <laughs> They're kind of crazy. Wittenberg wants a bit of money. Well, to keep you, that might be necessary. In fact, we're the only ones that can really offer that kind of patronage. So there you go, buddy. Take it. They're obviously being bullied by uh, someone. So what do you, what can you do? You know what? Build a fort there. Nice place to uh, build a fort. Get a police station. I should get a military base. Yeah, I know what I think about it. All right, we're about to get the Louvre. Yeah, the submarines are moving. I'm gonna try and flatten his uh, his capital city. Hopefully they're still moving. Move, my pretties, move! <laughs> yeah, they moved. 
Very good. On their way. Oh, he's got an atomic bomb there. That is nasty. That is really nasty. Yeah, the capital's gonna need uh, a shelter, bomb shelter. Oh, really? Bringing in a great merchant there, Wang and she. <laughs> Wang. My name is Wang. Yeah, cha-ching. Do your thing. But I'm gonna get a bonus with them. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I was just talking to him. Um, he's a really good friend. Very, very nice guy. Very nice friend. I've uh, known him for quite a few years, actually. But I should probably not... Yeah, that's personal matters. But yeah, he's a cool guy. Mainly mainly just in case he's watching. It's just like, yeah, cool guy. Yeah. <laughs> I do mean it, though. He's, uh, he's great. <laughs> Mombasa is in awe of me. Of course you are. Why wouldn't you be? Yeah, you, you know what, Persia? Go ahead. And yes, uh, what is it? Jerusalem is going to pop that awesome little culture thing. Well, it's not going to pop that culture. I'd love to pop that culture, but no. Ah, uh, every, every genuine, genuine work of art. Has as much reason for being as the earth and the sun. There we go, there's a Louvre. That's another kind of late wonder to get. Alright, we'll just keep our Golden Age going. Even though, I know, we could get more culture, but at the same time, it's more fun this way. Oh, get a burial tomb here. I like those. Maybe it'll entice, uh, entice uh, the Zulus to go to war with us. Not that I want that necessarily, but, you know, hey. Also, I know what I should build next turn. I should build a giant death robot. Because those things are freaking cool. Oops. Also, it's going to grip profit? Yeah, sure. To symbolize our ascension very soon into the great heavens, to the cosmos. Neil deGrasse Tyson said it best. Ooh, yeah. It's a very nice hinterland there, though. It's quite, it's quite lovely. It's got that leading tower there as well. Mm. And that main army. It's going to be great to crush this, honestly. <laughs> It's going to be beautiful. Because that's his capital. Destroying his capital is just... That's everything to him. Oh, man. Moscow had a really cool stuff. I, I like this. It's a, it's a really lovely city. She built the, uh, the Temple of Artemis. She was the one that built that. And she had coal here as well. Oh, man. It's nice. I mean, it's not amazing. Sure. But, okay, one wheat, two wheat, three wheat... Iron, cattle, got free sources of tea, she's got coffee. It's really lovely. Very, very lovely. Indeed, -de 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 -de. Still waiting for the Zulus, because the Zulus are slow. This would go much faster if it went for the Zulus and their massive turn of death. Yes. If only Sam's could shoot down, um, a, well, you think Sam's could shoot down atomic bombs because, uh, well, they could shoot down the bomber before they actually deliver the payload, but um, nuclear missiles you can't really shoot down. There is potential, you know, program in existence uh, by the United States and potentially Russia where they can shoot down nukes, but, you know, if you're sending, like, hundreds of nukes at once, if you saw my DEF CON game, you'll know how really difficult it is to attempt to shoot down nukes. Let's say you had that possibility. Why is everybody bringing their great merchants to Jerusalem? It's because it's the only place that's near me. Well, look at that. Jerusalem's in awe of me. Because they love me forever. Hopefully they never betray us. Like, in the end, they will betray us. Valletta technically loves us more than Jerusalem. But that's only because we've had a spy in there rigging the elections constantly. There we go. Nuclear fusion. Cool. Alright, add that to the, the pile. And yes, this great prophet is going to go and plop himself down somewhere. Where should we put him? Hmm. I don't know. Where should we pop him? Ba -da 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 -da. How about here? Yeah, because then we get like the flanking kind of situation between all these three uh, great prophet tiles. Ooh, yes, food. Food is good. It is great. 
Do that. Right, so we should also upgrade all of our fighters. They're not bombers. Can't do bombers yet. Uh, I do believe I upgraded this though. Yeah, I did. Let's upgrade all our tanks. So, you can upgrade our. Yep, f it costs five gold to upgrade our mechanized infantry. Just amazing. We also have this one. Boom. Uh, we can upgrade you. Boom. Uh, we can't upgrade you for some. Oh, we don't have enough aluminium. <gasps> we don't, do we? To build our. Um, what's it called? SS engine. But we will because we'll have the recycling center. So there is that. Yes, because there's only the SS engine to build and then we won the game. But yes, we are holding off for those um, for those submarines. We're going to launch those nukes at the capital of the Zulus as we leave. As we leave this world. Because we're going to get everybody on board, as many of our people as possible, onto this giant ship as well. We're just going to leave. We're going to go like, somewhere else to hide the Tesseract. Or, you know, alternative. <laughs> it's going to be great. Yeah. This is good. So, mechanized infantry bazookas. Bazooka. Bazookas are cool. If only there was an upgrade for the bazooka, though. Because there isn't. Globalization. Gain one additional delegate for our diplomats being in someone's car uh, capital. Not a bad idea. I'm not really spying on people for any per- Actually, I could do that. Ah, but we are going to go to war with the Zulus, technically. So I think, what, six turns? No. I think ten more turns and we'll have won the game. Yeah. Ten more turns. About. Probably less. So yeah. Ah, yeah, we're about to get this in one turn the world leader. We still can't be the world leader, but we can certainly try. <laughs> do 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 do. <laughs> Are you actually trading with me? No. Rejected. Do we actually have any trade routes coming from someone else to us? Um, trade routes. No, not really. There we go. Great rider. Also, build that tile. That's awesome. Might have enough faith for another, actually. And now we've got, yeah, so intercept, oh, and yes, quite a political treatise, which we can use to get another tenant for our thing. Hmm. Arsenal democracy. Combat increased. Volunteer army. It's all military-based, of course. Um. Well. Kind of just... What kind of sounds better? Arsenal Democracy sounds awesome. Their finest hour. The finest hour is really good. Yes. Yeah. Sure. And then if we get another social policy, which is very unlikely, but hey. There's the possibility there. So now, well, in a turn, we'll have the ability to produce that thing again. That caravan, go to Salamanca. You just stay there. Oh, you can... Ah, here we go. That's what we can do. And now we can build it. Where is it? SS Engine. Hmm. You know what? We'll get to our next social policy. Boom. Ten turns. Build a zoo. Yeah, there we go. That's what we'll do. We'll get to our next social policy. Because that's awesome. And yeah, these are our giant death robots. Of doom. They're amazing. Oh, let's upgrade you. It's a great well we can't upgrade you. But yeah, we have to do it kind of one at a time now. But hey, we've got it. 
you are going to work apparently that tile. That's all you can do now, isn't it? Wow, that's kind of sad. <laughs> yes, that's called depleting your environment, basically. <laughs> it gets to that point where it's just like, oh, we can't actually do anything else. Damn. Mm, you'll pay for this. You'll always pay. Pay for this in time. Yeah, we've got Jet Fighter. Oh, we still have a fighter in that city. But yes, we've got our giant death robots now, because they use uranium. They use up our, yeah, uranium. That's not uranium. Uranium. Okay. Let's see. Also, how much are they losing? How much money? Uh, oh, ho, 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 ho. negative 229. Dot, negative 2,000. Uh, 299. <laughs> 229. That would have been a bit intense. 229,000. But yeah, no. They're losing a lot of... Yeah, they're not getting any science. That's the thing. They're not really scientifically advanced enough anymore to do anything. Which is great. So we're just going to make sure that we uh, continue to be more awesome than them. Alright, we're going to get this recycling center. And then... We begin the great path. So in eight turns, that's when we're going to have victory. And I'm going to end this episode, like, here. So the next episode will be uh, the final episode. Which will be great. <laughs> well, not right here, but, you know. And yes, we are going to nuke them. So there's that to look forward to as well. Nuclear firepower! As we launch into space. If we launch into space. He could still, honestly, he could still bring in his atomic bombs and a giant army and still destroy me. He has eight turns to do it in. He's probably not going to do it, but he might still do it. I don't know what I'm going to get for my last uh, social policy. Fine arts. Now it'll be something cool. It'll be like I don't know. It'll be. It'll probably be the thing in freedom. Whoop! Careful. No world leader chosen. Yeah, we're not going to get to the next uh, thing of this. So we'll just go International Space Station. Finally, we'll do that. It's not going to happen. Alright, you can't upgrade anymore. And yes, we'll use this great musician. Sure. Haha! Oh. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I love that. That is just absolutely perfect. Spot on. That's what we're doing. Right, let's build some spaceship factories. Make it look like our empire is getting into like spaceship building mode. Brr. But yes, that is the perfect music for the uh, the, the moment. Now, I want to see when... I mean, obviously we're not going to get to this guy, but... Hey, another great scientist is cool to know. But what city? Might be able to speed him up if he's in one of the uh, lesser cities. Unfortunately, we won't know for a little while. Come on, show me! Oh. There we go. Heliopolis. Oh, oh no, because that's using all the specialists, specialists it possibly can. Yeah, it's going to get a granary. That's funny. One of the first buildings in, like, history. <laughs> Alright, oh, I was supposed to end this episode, wasn't I? Oh my god, I'm so bad at that. We'll do it very soon, once this turn ends. Yeah, the agonizing torture of the viewer. Haha, -ha. take that. Take that, viewer. Nah, I'm just kidding. I love you all. Please. Specifically, a certain, um, you know, thing that, a certain person that earns great merit. Yes. That is, yes, the key word. <laughs> da, 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 da. But yes, I like to go out with a bang. So we're going to have fireworks, which is awesome. <laughs> fireworks for our, for our launch. <laughs> Why are you building a new Lundy now? Still more research. Oh, and we got an infantry. Oh no, we got a um, a Sam. Ooh, hello. 
You know what? Sure, we'll go for this. Death of a great artist. Gain a free great work of art. Why not? Da, da, na, 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 na. It's a child's bath. That's a bit seedy. Um, oh, that sucks. It's going to take five turns. You know what? Grab an XCOM squad. Oh. That, oh. Oh, that's stupid. Mm. You know what? Do it anyways. Whatever. If it takes that long, then it takes that long. Right, I'll send you into the mountains, because I always like uh, putting things into the mountains. We'll fight them in the mountains. We'll fight them in the hills. But yes, we're preparing to for the great launch of our um for, of our rocket. Definitely great honest. Yeah. Oh, and we could subsidize things, but we're not going to, are we? No. Don't know why. Because we're not. That's why. Because we're not. Because we don't need them to. Oh, I did it again. Okay, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Tell who, till then.